Hello and welcome to Tungsten Tales. I'm John Scott and I'm here previewing every first round game of the Lakeside World Professional Dance Championship with Macy Ace, Chris Mason. Monday 8th of January, evening session again live on BT Sport. Ladies, Trina Gulliver, 10 times world champion, multiple world masters winner as well, up against Vicky Pruim, um, qualifier. She has been there before, but it's 2002. A long time ago, yeah. So, um, and ironically, played Trina, lost in the semi finals that time, but to Trina. So they've played each other on stage before. There was no shame losing to Trina back then. I mean, she was, she was the outstanding uh, women's player. And there was one start I found that I found remarkable. She's not won a ranking title this year. And I'd say that's probably the first time in at least 10 years, at least, that she's gone a season without winning a title. Uh, she won it back in 2016, which came totally out of the blue. She, you know, it looked nailed on that it was going to be Ashton or possibly Dita. Uh, but again, we've spoke about how important it is, is that mentality of winning that title on that stage. And again, when we all thought this, it was Dita's year, uh, that mental block came back and well, Trina rolled back the ears really in, in that final. And it's, you know, it was a, it was a shame for Dita, but. It was great to get that round off number of 10 titles for, for Trina, for us old romantics that, that, that love those kind of things. Uh, so, yeah, it's, um, it's an interesting game. And, and obviously Trina's right out of form to have not lifted, lifted a title for over 12 months. Uh, that, that's unusual. I'm not sure where her game is in, in terms of uh, how far she can go in this tournament. And, you know, her opponent here will, will probably fancy the job. She's still the seeded player, though, so she's obviously done enough yeah. to be up there, you know, with the likes she's of a winner. Headman. She's a winner. You know what she's all about. She's a ruthless winner as well. Uh, she's, you know, she was a, she, she was sort of the PD, PD, BDO's version of Phil Taylor in the women's game. Uh, she was just an out and out winner. So for her to go that long, you know, if Taylor went that long without a win, or MVG went that long without a win, or Durant or Adams, you'd start to think, hmm, are you really now on the slide? So yeah, I, I fear for her, and uh, she's only a, just a marginal favourite. I think she's twenty-eight to one for the title, uh, which you know the, she used to be odds on. So that shows you where everybody thinks her game is right now, and that's uh, that's another one. I think that's a coin flip. I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't go anywhere near it with your money, John. Stay tuned right here on Tungsten Tales in association with Winmore Darts for all the post-match interviews and live updates from the Lakeside World Professional Darts Championship.